In this video, I'm going to show you how to record a specific window or application in OBS Studio. So the first thing we need to do is just launch up OBS Studio and down in the bottom left hand side, you'll see all of your sources. Now, the first thing you want to do is just hide any sources that you currently have selected. So you can do that by selecting this eye icon next to it and make sure you have everything down here disabled. Once you've disabled all of these sources, we then need to decide what window we actually want to record. So for this demonstration, let's just say I wanted to record this folder over here. Now you can do this with any application or any window, but I'm just going to use this as an example. So you need to make sure you have your window open and then we're going to head back over to OBS Studio. Then you need to click on the plus icon down here to add a new source and select window capture. Then we're just going to give our new source a name. So I'm just going to call this folder and then click on OK. Now the important part is this window drop down over here. So this is where you want to select your window that you want to record. So for me, it's going to be this Adobe Premiere Pro folder that we just opened. And as you can see, you can even see this preview over here. The capture method, you're going to leave this as automatic. Sometimes you may actually need to change this to Windows 10, but in 99% of cases, you can just leave this as automatic. Then you want to decide whether you want to capture the cursor or not. For me, I want to capture my mouse cursor, so I'm going to leave this ticked and then you can press on OK. Now at the moment, it's placed in the left hand side of the screen. If you want to, you can right click on this and come down to transform and then you can select fit to screen. Now you can play around with this transform feature and you can have it stretched to your screen but it may look slightly strange because of the aspect ratio so I'm just going to keep mine here and I'm going to reposition this to the center of the screen like so and now all you need to do is select the source that we just created down here and then you can go ahead and press start recording. Now once it's recording it doesn't matter what window we go over to it's always going to be recording this window that we've selected so we can open up internet browsers or we can do anything in the background and it's only going to be recording this window here and it's really as simple as that guys if you did find this video helpful then let me know in the comments below and i'll see you in the next one